I've spent 1700 in this locker, but I'm sure we're gonna make it back best because Acadia has killer stuff. Hester thinks he ran me up on this locker. The only thing he knows how to run is his mouth. Hello. Nice tile top table, 50 bucks. Chairs, 30 bucks a chair. Hey, let's try not to break anything today too, if it's possible. Nice little wrought iron chairs, uh, 50 bucks a piece. Really nice lamp. So I'm gonna pay 50 bucks for that. Oh, cool. Little cannon. What was that? Really? How's it possible? It's not glued on. But would the best choice be put it sideways when we know the top is not on? Because I will cut somebody, I don't care. That's minus 50 bucks. This one is free, the next one you have to pay with blood. Our future. Little motorcycle and little cast iron school bus. Easily, with the box and everything, $200. Oh, check it out, school desk. Someone will pay 50 bucks for that. People love these old fans. It's easily 60 bucks. Nice mission style chair. That's a $300 chair. <sighs> Careful not to cut the wood. But you can tell it has a lot of age, natural wear to it. It's easily a $300 piece. Cowhide chair. Definitely real cowhide, 75 bucks. That's an interesting piece. Somebody will pay 100 for that, no problem. Oh, this is nice, look at this. Carved legs, carved up here, would guarantee 100 bucks. This is an interesting piece. Neon sign, oh, that's cool, that's an old neon sign. That is actually really cool. The cord looks super old, so that's something that I would guess is like from the 40s or 50s or even older. I have no idea what the value is on this piece. It is super cool, I mean, like this whole thing is like an old antique store. So I think I'm gonna put this piece aside and wanna see if I can make some phone calls. This looks like one of my favorite signs, the dollar sign. Wow, check this piece out. Every drawer has a different story and it's all hand carved. I'm gonna put a thousand dollars on it and see what happens. This looks like a solid unit. Has some doors on it, 150 bucks. Little oak office chair on wheels, 100 bucks. This piece right here, somebody will pay 200 bucks, no problem. All right, got two boxes. Oh, wow. <laughs> You know what, I'm not gonna unwrap this, we're just gonna sample it, get a little taste of the goods. I love samples. Like at Costco? Oh, this looks like China. Roast China, Japan. Beautiful piece. Lid right on top. Just full bubble wrap stuff with the gold leaf and a dish in the middle. There's probably like 70 pieces in there. Let's just say $15 a piece per bubble wrap. That's a thousand dollar box. The best part about this box, her sister's sitting right there. Yeah! Which is another thousand dollar box. They call these butlers, they're like very English. The artwork is nice, it's marble right here, mirror. I should be able to get like 500 bucks for that piece. And then right here we got a nice bar, super solid wood. That's easily another $300. I made four grand already, and I still gotta get this sign checked out. My work here is done. <sighs> Whoa, there's a lot of neon signs in here. I'm at Knights of Neon to see Lisa Schulte. Let's see what she found. She's the queen of neon. So Lisa, do you sell all these signs or do you just rent them? Oh, mostly I have a large collection that I've manufactured for the film and television world. Well, that's cool. All right, so what treasure did you find? I think it's some sort of old neon sign. Okay, wow. Well, this is certainly a rare collectible piece. I've only seen one other one of these ever, and it's in a museum, so. I like the sound of that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. When so. people tell me I've only seen one or I've heard of it. That's a good ding, sound. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> so how do we test it? Well, let's plug it in and see if it even works. Uh-oh, that's broken in the middle. No, this is a neon writing board produced by a company called Stuart Warner. These were used for displaying, you know, specials of the day. And it's sort of like our new dry erase boards that we have today. So we just okay. write on it? Uh, yeah, you wanna pick your color? Red. I'll make this professional. So what's happening is the neon is, you know, going through the glass and is picking up the pigment from the crayon. There you go. So you told me a museum quality sign. Yes. Now what is it worth? Well, you know, this is in uh, excellent condition. The mere fact that this tube is still working, it's the original tube from this piece when it was created in the 30s. I would say at the least, we might. Well, I like the way you're thinking. <laughs> I hope it's gonna add. <laughs> <laughs> I would say at least you're gonna get $1,000 for that. No, nice. for one the outside. <laughs> yes, exactly. That's awesome, yeah. thank you so much, high yes. five it. 
hear me? I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world!